Hey guys, it's Lee. Welcome back to my channel and to this What I've Worn This Week video. So it's not been a week since my last video. I uploaded the last one yesterday, which was kind of up until last weekend. But I was having a think and what I decided was, as I'm very often busy on weekends, I would switch it up to what I've been warming Wednesdays. Because generally on a Wednesday I don't have a huge amount on, so I do have more time in the evening to sit down and record these videos and then edit them and upload them. So I thought it would kind of make it a bit more consistent, hopefully, apart from when I'm on holidays for a week or two weeks, whatever, but that happens to all of us. So yes, I decided to go with what I've warmed Wednesday. Name might change, but the principle is the same. I did, um, I'll start with the, actually I'll start with the scenty ones, because there's less scenty ones this week. Um, so I finished up a bar of By the Sea, which is the scent of ocean air wafting through dewy seaside grass, and it's a fresh one. It is very fresh. Um, yeah, it's it's clean and fresh. Do like that one. Finished off a bar of sweet pea and vanilla. So this is ambience of raspberries and sweet pea petals with vanilla, and this one is really really nice I do really like this one though I've had this one since July 2021 so that's what 10 months so even though I like it it's not one I generally reach for very often it is quite nice in the bedroom as well as a lounge then I warmed through just one cube because it was in the kitchen of the turning red now on cold I wasn't fussed, I'm still not fussed of it on cold. But actually warming, it's not too bad. Um, it's probably one that probably warm in the kitchen just because it's um, it works quite well in there. So this is let your true self shine in a blast of bright pomegranate, juicy cherry and sugar cane made extra spirited with a vibrant orange twist. And it is fruity. Uh, certainly more fruity on warming than cold but yeah I this is why I probably will consciously try and warm through to use it up but it's okay <clears throat> then the non scentsy waxes um, I been warming through some black plum and rhubarb by Callan Candles which is actually in there at the moment and that's, that's pretty much what it says on the box it's predominantly rhubarb. Um, yeah, I don't really get black plum, though I suppose it's not as tart as rhubarb on its own. <coughs> Excuse me, then I warmed through some cranberry and mandarin splash, which I had from Naomi in Canada. And this one is mandarin, tangerine, lemon, cranberry, and red currant scent notes. And I've only used one cube had this in the utility room and this was actually a really good performer. I had this in a Yankee electric uh, element warmer and it performed really really well. I could actually smell it in the hallway as I walked down the stairs and that's where it was coming through the downstairs toilet window which opens into the utility room and I assume through the cat flap. So that was a really nice one and really strong and it lasted quite a while. Um, I think it's probably due to be changed this evening, so I'll clean it out tonight and then put something fresh in tomorrow. And then on to two which I had last week or on the weekend from Melissa Johnson or Melissa Johnson Hate in the States was Fierce Morning Sex by Rose Girls. So this is Fierce Abbott Crombie Fitch Type and Spa slash Fresh Masculine. And I had this going in my little garden element warmer on top of the stairs, and it was really, really nice. It's very nice. I almost, I almost want to get hints of chocolate from it, but I don't know if that's a note in the fierce. Um, it's a long time since I smelt it, 
but very, very nice and performs really well in the little garden. And then lastly, this was another one I had from Melissa. So this is Sleep Tight by Sassy Girl Aroma. And this is Lavender, Chamomile and Vanilla Bean Noel. And as I said, Vanilla Bean Noel uh, pocket back there from Naomi, which is almost gone. I'm down to like probably my last squirt or two. This one is absolutely beautiful. It really is. It's just... I've had this in my child warmer in the bedroom and it's lasted really well. I put it in is it Sunday night. Yeah, Sunday night. So it was on Sunday night, Monday night and last night. Um, and I think it. I will probably get at least another night from it. Um, maybe tonight and tomorrow possibly. Um, <coughs> this one is, I used two sprays out of the bar and yeah I generally put it on about eight o'clock at night eight nine o'clock um, to just really send to bed before I go to bed and then it's on a automatic timer that um, if it's on it will switch off at 1 a.m. so it does go for quite a few hours each night and yet yeah, that is really really nice really impressed with the performance of Sassy Girl Aromas or Sassy Girl Aroma so that's it my basket be empty um, probably will fill up now because obviously this has only been since I think Sunday no Saturday I think um, yeah because I went away Friday night so then when I came back Saturday I switched and start to make the pile ready for this week but as I said I'm going to switch to what I've warmed Wednesdays so if you think what I've warmed Wednesdays is a good idea because I can be a bit more consistent leave a comment down below and don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already done so and that's it for me and I hope the weather is nicer where you are because it's currently lashing down with rain here Especially as I had planned on going to try and get some more plants planted. A bit disappointing, but I might just brave it and go out in the rain. Because it is just rain and it needs to be done. So that's it for me this evening. And I hope this video finds you well. And until next time, take care, stay safe and happy warmings. See you soon. Mm -hmm.